Hi guys, so today we went to the Strand bookstore. It's at 828 Broadway at 12th Street. And of course I have to get stuff. So I got Witches by Roald Dahl. I don't really know what this is about except for the fact that it's about witches. But I've heard this is very, very creepy. I don't know if it's as creepy as Coraline by, who's Coraline? What? Neil Gaiman, I think is, is it, is it by Neil Gaiman? I don't remember, but I've heard that this is really, really creepy, but, um, I love Roald Dahl. I love Matilda. It's one of my favorite children's books of all time, and Halloween is upon us, so, or coming very, very soon. So I thought this would be a perfect sort of ball of read. Then I guess there was apparently a witch's theme going on. I got The Witches of New York by Amy McKay. Apparently about this group of witches living in New York and about one of them in, back in 1880. And then it's just about, I guess, them coming into their power, one of them coming into their power uh, and sort of like darkness and secrets that lie within the city of New York. So I just moved to the city of New York and I love witches and it is fall. So perfect book for that, no? Then I went to the, um, they had like an LGBTQ section and I got Orlando by Virginia Woolf and I got it in this vintage edition which has like angel wings and a red spine, and it's beautiful, and it was only six dollars, six ninety-five. So I thought it was a really good price. Um, I don't, I have never read any Virginia Woolf, and I definitely need to rectify that. And I've heard this is an amazingly beautiful book about just um, exploring sexuality and history, and it's beautifully written. And so I'm really, really excited to read it. And Oh, look at that. It says, undoubtedly one of the most singular novels of our era by Jorge Luis Borges, which I actually ha also have never read, but he's one of those um, Latin American authors that I really, really need to, need to get to. And if you're reading or looking for any recommendations for anything for the Latino Heritage Month, then Jorge Luis Borges is probably one that we should all check out. And so, yeah, those are the three books that I got at the brand um two of them were under 10 bucks so not bad um i hope you guys enjoyed the second installment of new york bookstores i don't know where we'll go to next i don't really plan them i just sort of look whenever we're going into the city i look for bookstores that are around the area that we are already planning to be at and then i make anyone who's with me go to the bookstore <laughs> Namely, just Lewis, who's now pretending he's not listening to me. What? <laughs> so I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know again if there are any bookstores that you really want me to go to. I added a bunch from the last video that I did. Um, I didn't know that there was an Amazon bookstore, so I really want to check that out. Um, and so yeah, love you guys. Stay safe.